Well, hello everyone, Larry back with you again, and all I can say is it's a beautiful day here in Northwest Alabama. Uh, what we're working on this morning is um, mounting some brackets on the bucket that has a hook and a D-ring attached to the bracket. There's times when I'd like to um, strap something on or use a chain and, and um, hook it on to the bucket here. I had these on Little John that I got from bolt-on hooks. These here actually came from Amazon and the reason I like these is because they do have the D-ring and the hook. So uh, going to get these installed real quick this morning. Thank you for joining us here on the channel. I hope you enjoy it and if you do give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to leave a comment down below if you've got an idea or a suggestion. Share it with a friend. Please subscribe to the channel. So come on folks, let's get started attaching these uh, hooks and D-rings to Big John's loader bucket. I buy quite a bit of stuff from bolt-on hooks, but I saw these on Amazon, and actually they were a little more along the line of what I wanted, and I'll show you what's in the box here. I got both of the, um, both of the brackets here. Obviously there's a right and a left whichever way you want to configure it. If you want to hook on the inside, I think I want to hook on the outside. So we got that. And then we got all the, um, the mounting hard hardware. And what you got here is the hook and then the D-ring and these will mount on the uh, loader. We'll show you kind of the position that I uh, think we'll uh, mount these in and I don't want to go here because it raises it up because of this uh, bracket but I want to keep it as close to that bracket as possible so I'm either going here or here and I think just for the sake of, uh, of mounting things I'm going to go somewhere in here. And so we'll get these bolted on. I'm going to start by getting these positioned where I, where I want them. And again, I think we're gonna put the hook on the outside. There's a right and a left, or left and right, whichever way you're looking at it. And as I said, I can't do it here which would be ideal, but I don't, I don't like the gap. Here I really like the added strength, so I think we're going to go in this position here. Go ahead and just measure these from, right there is six inches from that side. And there's six inches from that side. Make sure everything is up flush. And uh, get the holes marked. I'm going to start by drilling a, a smaller 
kind of a pilot hole. Making this bolt out, let me get uh, inches on here. Right at 49, right at a half an inch. Let's check this uh, drill bit. The drill bit measures just a little over what the uh, other one, in fact, it, it's right at a half inch. This, this appears to be just a little under a half inch, so maybe I believe using this bit here will work really well and it'll give a little bit of play for the bolt to go down through. The bolts themselves are three quarter inch, or the, the nut is three quarter inch, and the bolt is three quarter inch. It's coming with a flat washer and then a lock washer, and actually they've put a, um, a lock nut in here. It's got a neoprene uh, insert in it that makes this uh, a lock nut, so maybe we can get these um, on here and They'll be secure. Get another set here on this side. And again, these are three quarter, so I've got a three quarter inch socket on here. And we'll get these uh, tightened down. Okay, I've moved the camera around so that I won't be getting my behind. Okay, got that one installed.
Well, I think that's going to do it for today. Thank you so much for joining us here on the channel, St. Nick's Farms. I really do appreciate it. I would ask that you uh, give us a thumbs up if you like the channel or if you uh, uh, maybe got an idea from it, something that you can use or or you saw some, some of the equipment that I have that maybe would be uh, of benefit to you. Um, leave a comment down below, share it with a friend, and please don't forget to subscribe. If you're watching this on your phone, there's a little subscribe button down here. I think it's in this side here. and. Uh, you, that's a link that you can go to and subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell so you get notice of future videos when we publish one. We usually try to do one every week. So uh, that's about it. Thank you so much. Thank you for joining us. Till next time, this is Larry. Bye bye, everybody. Take care. Stripes and bright stars.